Hello everybody, I'm the Craft at Killer Creator and today I'm showing a process video for an out of this world space card. In this video I will be showing how I create a galaxy background, arrange a balloon display and heat embossing. Before I begin I would like to ask you to get clicky for Vicky. This is my own catchy way of asking you to like, share, comment and subscribe. For this card I used Lawn Fawn out of this world stamp set. My favourite things, watercolour rectangle stencil, black cardstock, distress oxide inks in cracked pistachio, chipped sapphire, wilted violets and uncharted mariner. As ever, I, the other items that I use will be mentioned and then added in the description box below. I begin by using by securing a stencil to the cardstock using a low tack tape. I use Picket Fence Studio ink pouncers to apply ink to the cardstock, adding layers of colour to build it up. Then it's time to splatter with a variety of media. First I use a solution of Lawn Fawn Liquid Stardust and Water sprayed in a fine mist. Next I add splatters of plain water and finally I mix a little Copic acrylic white paint with water for white splatters. I used a heat gun to dry the wet techniques and then set it to one side to let it dry completely. I stamped the images that I want to use on Nina Classic Crest 80 pound cardstock using Memento Tuxedo Black Ink. I select my Copic colours within a colourful arrangement of planet balloons in mind. The Copic caps can be seen on the screen on my little star block. Off screen I fussy cut the images and arranged them into arranged the planets into an array of balloons and once happy I glued them together. I then took some DMC sparkly black thread and cut some strands. I attached these to the back of the image using clear tape. Finally I tied a knot to bring all of the strings together. I originally wanted to heat emboss and stamp the direct stamp the sentiments directly onto it but alas some of the stamping was unclear and of course I hadn't used a misty. This was easily fixed though as I knew I'd be able to stamp and heat emboss some sentiment strips instead. Before I complete the assembly of the images, I mounted the galaxy background onto a piece of Lawn Fawn silver metallic cardstock. I edited out the struggle I had with getting this straight, it took a while. Then I added foam squares to the images and liquid glue to the sentiments. Here 
Here is a shot of the completed card. I love the galaxy background and the way the plants are arranged as balloon. What's your favourite thing about it? Please comment below the video. This card was inspired by episode 211 of Craft Roulette. The parameters can be seen on the screen. We have a card wishing good tidings for a birthday, summer colours in the balloons, the astronaut is wearing a mechanical suit and the balloons are tied together. With mention of craft roulette and parameters, I have included a slide of what it is all about and hope if you haven't already, subscribe to Craft Roulette on YouTube. It's so much fun. Thank you so much for watching and please remember to get clicky for Vicky. It would mean the world to me. Ta-ta for now everyone. Take care and I'll be back soon.